This is the Tech Podcast Network. If it's tech, it's here. Nick here again with F5Live.tv, part of the Tech Podcast Network and TPN.tv. We're here at the Prize Monkey booth to see what this thing is and what it does. So let's take a look. CES 2012 coverage is sponsored in part by GoDaddy.com. Get 25% off their fourth generation hosting by using promo code CES2. Find more GoDaddy deals at TBN.tv. Hey, I'm here with Brad Thorne, co-founder of Prize Monkey, here at the Prize Monkey booth. I, I can't even begin to explain why we stopped. I saw a yellow box with a monkey on it, an animated screen, and, and, and here I am. I'm, I am curious, I'm interested, and, and I suppose go. That's how we're going to start this thing. What is Prize Monkey? Why are you here? Uh, Prize Monkey is based on the idea that people love free stuff. And uh, people love free stuff, especially when it's instant. And instant gratification is what we do. So Prize Monkey gives away uh, free prizes instantly when you use your mobile device. Awesome. And how exactly does it do that? Uh, we have basically a box here that talks to the cloud. And it, we call it the unkiosk. So there's no touch screen, no buttons on here. And it really relies uh, on the mobile device as a point of interaction. So as people were walking by and they're going, what is Prize Monkey? What is that monkey doing? Why is he jumping around in there or whatever he's doing? Uh, there's different prompts of different things that they can do to either share items with the monkey or impact him in some way. And that kind of draws people in to get their phone out or get their tablet out and go ahead and interact with him. And when they do that, they get prizes. Very cool. Always people like free things. So that's just a natural extension. What made you get on board with this, this project or the idea of starting this outside of people just wanting free things that are cool? Well, uh, like most good ideas, I think they start with kids. And my children, uh, I have uh, three children, but my oldest daughter and my son love going to the dentist. And that just sounds crazy, but they love going to the dentist. It's an experience that most kids are like afraid of. And they're, they focus on the little Disney princess uh, uh, toothbrush that they get or the little car's toothbrush that they get. And I said, wow, wow, if they could just be totally cool with going to the dentist for a little toothbrush that's all people really want is, hey, what's in it for me? What can I do? How can I use my phone or my device to really impact the world around me and, and receive uh, a reward for doing that? So like my kids who go to the dentist are rewarded for doing that and they come home, hey, dad, look what I got. I think a lot of people really enjoy the concept of getting something and not really knowing what's going to come out and, and being able to get something for doing something fun. Right, and you can tailor that for a demographic, I would assume. So if people like a certain product or, or someone wants to get in on certain things, you'll have different products inside of here that, that, that you can uh, pretty much access and see what they like and go from there, I would assume. Yeah, that's exactly right. Uh, companies are creating promotional products that really are a lot of fun, that uh, herald uh, new games, new MMOs, new movies and media that are coming out all the time. So they fit niche interests, things that people are really interested in. And those are the types of things that we really try and uh, acquire for Prize Monkey. So the companies are happy to uh, uh, sponsor promotional items that uh, help them reach consumers. And consumers are happy to get items that fit the interests and things that they're into. Awesome. And I, I, I'm sure we can see a demo of this thing, and we'll, and we'll do that right after we take a break here and have a word from our sponsors. When you do as much content production as we do here at F5Live.tv and, of course, at the Tech Podcast Network at TPN.tv, you can imagine that we need a server that can handle the workload at any time when we need it most. So we chose GoDaddy. GoDaddy.com has a great new 4G hosting system that uses server clusters to provide the exact workload you need when you need it. And if one server goes down, that's okay because there's other ones that will pick up the load and maximize and make sure you are running when you need to. So right now, GoDaddy has an awesome deal for you because you're listening here on this broadcast. If you need one-year shared hosting, you can pick one up today and get 25% off by going to GoDaddy.com and at the checkout screen using coupon code CES2. So that's, again, GoDaddy.com and at the checkout screen use code CES2 for 25% off a one-year shared hosting plan. So let's set the scenario for this demo. Go ahead and lay this out for me. Where would be, be the optimal use of this product? Well, we put something together specifically for CES 2012. So here we are at the show, and we knew we were going to have visitors walking by, walking by our booth here, and we wanted to go ahead and set it up to run on an iPad, and we figured this was uh, uh, the most uh, common device for most people to be familiar with uh, in the tablet 
space. So we put this up here uh, and said, hey, thanks for visiting us here at our Prize Monkey booth. Um, I've set it up here where basically you put in your email address, tells you a little bit about Prize Monkey. And what I have here on my screen right now is actually the redeem screen where you see that, hey, you've earned some bananas for visiting us, touch the bananas to redeem. So we go ahead and press that button. And then that is telling the server that, hey, we've gone ahead and, and redeemed, and that's talking to the box. So we don't actually have to touch the box at all, and our prize comes out right in here. Very cool. <laughs> so this is a little, uh, little table hockey uh, a prize we have here that we've been giving out all day. Awesome. And you're looking to expand, I would assume, in, in getting on board with uh, loyalty points and that kind of thing and kind of making those things important again, right? Yeah, I think instant gratification applies to a lot of different verticals. And I think uh, it's all about being in the moment, right? I mean, so you're at a space, maybe you're at a store, and you have an opportunity to take a picture of you being at the store and share it with your friends, and we can reward you for doing that. Um, football stadiums and sports programs, certainly there's a lot of uh, opportunities to connect with uh, uh, visitors and, and delivering things like sports memorabilia when they're there using their devices. And certainly everyone's using their devices at nearly every venue they're going to now. So this is a great way to... Um, stimulate a conversation with them and kind of give them a reward for doing that. Awesome. And obviously, I would assume there's a website for people to get more information from. Am I correct on that? Yeah, it's, it's pretty straightforward. It's prize-monkey.com, spelled just the way it sounds. And uh, we're going to be adding some new interactions there over the next uh, a short while here and some different things that you'll be able to do with, uh, with uh, three of our monkey characters. Awesome. Very exciting things. A lot of room for expansion and ideas to just really blossom. There's a lot of potential here for anything to really take off. So Thank you. I appreciate your time, Brad. Thank you. Thank you very much. Awesome. All right. Thanks. So as you can see, Prize Monkey actually makes more sense when you look beyond just the crazy yellow box that it is. I'm excited for the potential. Obviously, stay tuned if you want more continued coverage of International CES 2012 at F5Live.tv and, of course, at the Tech Podcast Network at TPN.tv. This is the Tech Podcast Network. If it's tech, it's here.